created by Dr. Farzana Hamid and Dr. Muhammad Hamid in 1992, um, mainly catering to um, battered and abused women and domestic violence. Um, there was a huge need for that um, at that time because not only is it a physical abuse, it also is a mental abuse. Um, the program started um, with that, um, went into behavioral health. Um, over the years, we have um, really built a community. We have a shelter in the um, Addison area, and um, as well as mental health in both Chicago and in um, Addison. We provide services um, for uh, domestic violence counseling, for um, anger management, um, visitations, um, you know, supervised child visitations with couples that are going through um, further uh, domestic issues. Um, now we have become into an FQHC as well, starting last year. We've been serving the community, um, getting uh, people in and educating them. Um, as Zahra earlier said, the education is very, very important. Um, and we and we believe that education, especially health and mental health education, is the core of it. And then going on further, because if you don't understand yourself, your own health, um, you cannot go further in understanding other education. Um, so we have a complete program for um, training and education. Um, we constantly have in-site as well as out-of-sight educational seminars. Um, we recently par partnered up with the Bosnian Islamic Community Center, um, and we're going to be doing weekly education with them, starting with um, you know, women health and then mental health and continuing on. Um, we have services for seniors, we have the adult day care um, for seniors, as well as a home care for seniors. Um, there are a lot of seniors that come from back home, they don't know where to go, what to do, they can come to our facility, as well as going into American, of course. Um, and uh, they can also get help for someone to come home and help them cook, clean, or just sit with them. Because they're no longer in the environment they, they used to be. They're in this cold environment, stuck inside of the home and they need some sort of companionship. Um, and the home care aides are well-trained and they provide all sorts of services. Um, our services are multi, multi-lingual. We have Urdu, Hindi, Punjabi, Gujarati, Arabic, Bosnian, Croatian, Ser Serbian, Russian, Spanish, um, and I know now we have a few French volunteers as well. Um, so to people who are like, well, they don't speak our language, we do. We speak almost every language that's possible. Um, we help with um, seniors trying to get their social security benefits. Everybody knows it's very difficult, especially to go down to the social security office and um, you know wait there for such a long time. We have case managers that help with that. I myself am a navigator um, for the ACA with Hamdar. Um, we partnered up with CCN last year, and now we're um, you know helping everyone get educated, first of all, on the Obamacare Act. Um, sorry, Affordable Care Act. I'm confusing it myself today, um, but it's it's known as same thing, yeah. You know? um, and and then you know helping them get insured, um, and then helping them choose providers. A lot of people are very much confused. How do I choose a plan? How do I do this? There's hundreds of plans on there, so we guide them step by step. You know of how to talk to your doctor and see how they um, what insurances they take your hospitals and whatnot. Um, our main, um, still our biggest focus is our domestic violence program and um, the mental health program, which, co which connects with the domestic violence program. Um, and I think that's all I have to say today. Um, if you guys have any questions or any concerns, you can of course come up to me. I will be here after um, everyone's done speaking. I can give you answers. I also have brochures that I'm gonna leave in the front. Um, do come in, come and visit our location. And um, you know, um, if you guys want to partner with us for educational purposes, for any sort of trainings for anyone, do let us know. Thank you very much.